The people we spoke to in Kigali City commended the way basic services have continued to be provided without any problems despite the threat of the COVID-19 coronavirus and the lockdown in place, with all people catered for, even those ill with other diseases. Even though the transportation of essentials like foodstuff is allowed and being facilitated, truck drivers say getting back to the city after making deliveries is proving difficult. I may take maize flour to, say, Ruyenzi, with no problems. But getting back over the Nyawarongo bridge becomes a problem. The same thing when I take rice to Nyamata. Coming back is troublesome when the truck is empty. I therefore ask the traffic police personnel not be so hard on us when we are returning with empty trucks so that we can continue supplying different parts of the country, just like the directives from the minister's state. The financial sector has continued to function as well, with measures introduced to encourage people to turn towards a cashless society as a way of reducing the risk of people getting infected during transactions with paper and coin money. As a bank, we have continued to operate so that people have access to their money. And we still encourage people to use technology for all their transactions and go cashless. We are also implementing the central bank's directives meant to reduce the amount of paper money in circulation to help people stay safe from the virus. Also, we ask our customers who have checks to have the money deposited directly onto their accounts or have the issuer come and withdraw it themselves. Measures like this have helped to keep things going, while at the same time mitigating the threat that COVID-19 has continued to pose.